An eye disease known as macular degeneration leaves people unable to see clearly and do common daily tasks like reading or driving. Anita Brickman joins us now with details about a new test to help catch it early and perhaps slow it down. Anita? That's right, Derek. As with many diseases, when you catch it early, you can do something. With macular degeneration, it can help stabilize any further progression and save what eyesight a person has left. Now there's a first-of-its-kind test to watch for changes at home. Elizabeth Santee is an active 83-year-old who lives alone and loves to read. She certainly wasn't prepared to lose her vision. Her eye problem started back in 1980 when she was diagnosed with dry macular degeneration in her right eye. What basically happens is that there's aging and thinning of the macula in the center of the retina. Over time, the disease progressed to wet AMD, when fragile vessels behind the macula leak fluid and blood, wiping out a crucial part of a person's sight. I have no central vision. It's only peripheral vision. Since her right eye was caught too late, specialists wanted to make sure the same thing didn't happen to her left, making her legally blind. So Dr. Richard Garfinkel with the Retina Group of Washington introduced Elizabeth to a home monitoring system, 4C Home AMD Monitor. It can detect distortion of vision before the patient even knows anything's wrong. It is a test that the patients use at home. It takes a couple of minutes for each eye, and the information goes directly to a monitoring center and it's reviewed and analyzed each day for abnormalities. And after only a month of using the system, Elizabeth's doctor was notified those abnormalities were there. Turns out that she had a big problem, but it was too early for her to be able to detect herself. The device detected it. Elizabeth had three months of intensive treatment and now doctors have the macular degeneration under control. And I am convinced that the early detection has saved my eyesight. Now she no longer needs the treatment, but she still needs the monitoring to make sure nothing changes in that other eye. There is no cure for AMD, but treatments can control how fast it progresses.